Ryan Funk gets the only helper on that one, a 6.39. And that makes it a 6-1 hockey game. Power play goal, too, for Kamloops. So we're kind of bragging a little bit about the Cougars' penalty killing on that road trip being 85%. Now we got a fight here. Asichuk went down rather awkwardly on the fight, but he's still throwing him here, and then he takes one as well. And uh, that is Underwood for Kamloops. I didn't see how it started, but definitely caught how it ended as they both went to the ice. And Spencer Asichuk, I think, still wants to go with Underwood. Underwood caught him with a bit of a late one as well when Asichuk was on the ice, but they both were wanting to keep swinging at each other, and they still have players for each other as they go to the penalty box. Yeah, that one might uh, continue to develop throughout the game, but fighting here to both players, it will not be an instigator. Penalties at the 6.54 mark in the second period. A game that, simply put, has belonged to Kamloops tonight. You know, the Cougars have just made too many mistakes this evening to get away with it. It doesn't matter who you're playing in this league. This is too good of a league with so much parity. We hear that word all the time, how even teams are. Kamloops, you know, they're 17 points ahead of them in the standings going into tonight's game. And they've got some decent players as well. The Cougars have just made too many errors in front of their own net at center ice and in the offensive zone.